I mean, it was the first day back to work in the beginning of 2011. I've had a pretty good 2011, and it might have been different if, if the car had acted differently that day. So, yeah. It was an absolutely gorgeous morning, a little bit chilly, 55, 56 degrees. I remember thinking, wow, what a great way to start the new year. I turned just for a brief moment. And because I was distracted, you know, I didn't notice what was going on. The lane that I was traveling in had come to a complete stop due to traffic. I never saw the traffic stop. I remember briefly hearing uh, multiple beeps. I was traveling over 45 miles an hour. I grabbed the steering wheel and I saw the car in front of me, you know, as I was rushing toward it, it was at a dead stop. It was clearly too late for me to do anything. I heard the beep, beep, beep as my Mercedes collision system automatically kicked in. The next thing I know, my Mercedes was stopped uh, without hitting the car in front of me. And I just was shaking. You know, the, the, the Mercedes stopped itself. And uh, at that moment, I didn't even know what happened. You know, it, it all happened so fast. Um, it, took, it took me some time to recover. You know, I don't think my heart rate came down for 20 minutes. I was shaking in the car. The thought of what I could have done to someone else, because I momentarily wasn't paying attention, uh, wow, that's a scary feeling. Well, I've been doing software development my whole life, and I have a great deal of respect for innovation, uh, uh, particularly in the, in the realm of software. Watching what Mercedes has done, and bringing together these sensors in a car with software that has the ability to save your life. You know, that really is the fulfillment of software. That's what, that's magical software. So I have a tremendous amount of respect and admiration for the innovation that Mercedes is bringing uh, into, their, into their cars. Of course, I have a new level of respect um, as, it, as it begins to affect your, your, your own life and your own family. That's when we just got our house. That's when me and my brother were little. Like many others, I work really, really hard. But you work hard as a means to an end. And that end is really about uh, being a great dad and a great husband. I feel very indebted to, uh, to, to Mercedes. They fundamentally altered uh, the year I was having. And of course, we don't know what would have happened if I had actually been in a collision, but certainly I could have affected someone else's life. And so there's somebody else who's indebted to Mercedes as well, but doesn't even know it. <laughs>